So I got this host gator baby plan for $4.50 for 36 months or three years. And then today I got a new email that says I owe them $593 for my baby plan is a total of $632. So they reel you in with $162 to start your website, which seems fine. And then three years later, you have to pay $600 if you want to renew. And then uh, you could buy, you know, start a new plan, right? I want to start a new thing, but it costs you $150 if you want to migrate your website over to the new plan. So I was just crying because, you know, like people who have websites, a lot of them are poor people. A lot of them are entrepreneurs. A lot of them are just wanting to make it. And here, HostGator, what do they offer? I'm telling you, nothing. For $630 for three years, nothing. And I mean, you know, people need to be good to people. There is a God that watches you. Love your neighbor as yourself is a command. You cannot tell me that it costs you $630 to give me a service and make a profit. I'm, I'm, I'm outraged. And so I decided to give up my website. Uh, I wasn't using it, but you know, for people that were, or people that are, you know, I, I, I am so angry with that because entrepreneurship is hard and few people make it and they want to keep making it. They want to try to make it and to charge them $630. And if you don't, then you lose all your work that you've done. And you put it all together, right? Yeah, that was me. You didn't do a thing. Not a thing. Not a thing did you do to help me. And yet you charged me $630 just to put my website. Yes, you did help me with some customer service. But I tell you, it is the most annoying thing to to take care of a website. It is difficult. It is stupid. It is not a good product. It is not a good product. It's not user friendly. Not worth six hundred and thirty dollars for three months. It's a fucking rip off. I'm so sorry if you don't like swearing, but it is, and I am angry. And I really want the world, I am going to ask. I want to start a service, a web hosting service that will actually be user friendly, good to use, happy customers. And when I have money, I am going to do that. Something that would be so good. I would be happy paying for a product that was good. You know, something that gave me great we a great website. Something that was really easy to use. But that's not what I got. And you're asking me to pay $600 to renew it? And so many people are poor who have websites and they just want to make it. And it's their goal, it's their hope, it's their dream. And you're fleecing them. And they're poor. Shame on you, HostGator. And shame on you, any other... All of the services are bad. We need 
to fight back with something good and they need to be all put out of business. The last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pray and I'm gonna pray against HostGator and uh, all companies like them. And I'm gonna pray for there to be better options and uh, a company that would care about its people, uh, its customers. So, dear Lord my God, I praise you for the internet and for entrepreneurship and for websites and uh, just the dreams that people have. I praise you for helping entrepreneurs and for being the God of entrepreneurship and the God of dreamers. And I pray, Lord, that you would stand up against these bullies that want to suck your people dry. And I pray that we would have a good option, like a really good web hosting service. Um, I pray that you'd help me create one that would rival HostGator and all of the legacy companies. I pray that I would meet the right person to form that company and that uh, we would put HostGator out of business. I pray that all of the companies that do these things to entrepreneurs um, would be put out of business. And I pray for a revolution of entrepreneurship and uh, government support. Uh, and I, I pray that they would be exposed for the vampires that they are. And I pray that uh, we would have a renaissance of entrepreneurship and that people would know that you fight for the entrepreneur. And uh, I ask that you would make it beautiful and um, help us. I'm, I'm, I'm so sad today. And I pray that you would just do really, really big things here with new, new people, new blood, people that care about entrepreneurs to be, um, to hold the keys to websites and, uh, so that, you know, the little guy doesn't get squeeze for another, you know, $200, $300, $400, $500 so they have nothing. And I pray that you would just, that they would have to pay for the pain that they put people through. In Jesus' name, amen.